Hi, welcome to an NX12 video tutorial. I want to do this air blade or propeller in NX. I did a similar one in Cartier a while ago. I used a swept and a curve and a law. So let's have fun with NX12. Okay, let's start with a sketch. I will use only one sketch and do all my curves in one sketch. Of course you could do it in three or more sketches. First I need a spline. And this might look something like this. Confirm make it symmetric this point to that one with that axis then you can select all those other points like this close that one and put this point onto that axis Coincident. Let's see what the size is. Yeah, let's go for two six zero. Close this one. Then I need a line which should start over here, go over there. These points should be aligned vertical these as well and that line might be coincident to that axis maybe adjust those points a little bit you can adjust it afterwards anyways Okay, I want to add a line here. Okay, and that's it. Finish that sketch. Now go for a swept. Go for single curve. This would be the profile, the section. The guide would be this one. The orientation should be controlled by an angular law, and the scaling method should be done with this curve. Now I go for angular law, linear. 55 to minus 55 degrees looks good make it a sheet confirm and then do a circular pattern go for pattern geometry I want to pattern this surface circular the vector would be this axis two instances 360 degrees and confirm and I'm done now you could use thicken so let's go zoom those two okay and then you could use thicken to add some thickness to that surface maybe one that's minus one in both directions and now I'm done so I hope you enjoyed this short video 
If you liked it, please give it a like or leave a comment. If you want to see more, please give it a like or leave a comment. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Please subscribe to my Facebook cat fan page. I want to get more likes and subscriptions over there as well. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Bye bye.